Hello my strange ones and happy birthday Yasmin as of yesterday. I'm glad you had a good birthday. Uh, we tried to make you a collaborative happy birthday video but the odds were not in our favor as it tends to be sometimes with this channel just getting things to happen tends to be a little bit tricky or uploading things but yeah there's just some sort of something that it just wasn't working but that's okay because you know you love you and I am happy you exist so happy birthday yay for being 16 I wish I could have been there for your birthday party sorry I couldn't have been but you know what I I'm gonna be exactly like 19 hours from your house by car this summer so we should do something you should come and see me because I will be with a group of people and probably not allowed to leave but I will be in Austria and I m Google mapped it and got directions to the general vicinity of Wales so that takes about 19 hours to get there so yeah I'll let you know when that's gonna be and you can come to me and we can just look at each other and I can poke you and you will exist so schooling I'm still homeschooled but I'm doing courses online and they are f uh, fine it's just easy to get behind on work for those because 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 da -da 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 just cause. As a kid I always wanted to have that stuffed animal that was like my favorite thing ever. That was my best friend and I took everywhere with me and I went through phases of that and I would have animals that I would keep with me all the time for like a month and then I'd get a new favorite animal and yeah so I never had that one as a child that was like my favorite. I actually did. My mother made me a sock animal. It was like a used sock and it wasn't like a sock monkey because I have one of those and it is cute. This was like a sock, like a bunny sock. It was really ugly and I had it for so long and the eyes kept falling off because they were just glued on buttons. And oh my goodness, that thing, I loved it so much and I cuddled it. And it was like one of my dad's old socks and legit it just like fell apart and oh my goodness, totally forgot about that. But yes, there was that. And then when I was about nine, I got this guy and he has been my companion every night for the past nine years. We're like an old married couple. We're like an old married couple. Oh my goodness, girls, it is too late and I was up late last night. The story behind him is um, when I was nine, my grandma was in the hospital to get cancer removed from her neck and my grandma is one of my favorite people and yeah, so when I was there, I got this toy because we spent a lot of time in the hospital. We kept going to the gift shop and I saw Baby Iceberg and I just wanted him a lot and we kept going there a lot, especially while my grandma was recovering. And I don't know exactly when, but I got this bear and I think it was a night when we, my mom and I were sleeping over in a hotel around where the hospital was. I remember Baby Iceberg then was so new and so white and so beautiful that my uncle was there and I told him he had to wash his hands before I touched him because I was told I had to do that so he wouldn't get dirty and the funny thing is now that doesn't matter because he's disgusting and that's okay I love him alright we're doing challenges rolling dice having to do stuff stuff now so my challenge for whoever I roll is going to have to do their next video in a public place. You have to film it in a public place. Like a park or a library. Probably not that one. Or just some place where there's actual people. It can't just be like outside where no one is. It has to be. There has to be people watching you. And when did you ask him? I got a six. What does that mean? Two. Ariel. Ariel, are you doing Sophie's challenge as well? Okay, so I just watched it, and yes, Ariel, I did roll a two. So now you have to do both challenges. I feel really bad because you're on crutches. You can just sit in a public place and reenact a scene from Harry Potter 
with household objects with people watching. I'm sorry. I love you. Please do that because that would make me really happy. <laughs> I'm sorry. If you can't do that, let me know. But I want it to happen because it's just a beautiful mental image. Oh my goodness. Alright, have a good weekend everyone and it is now really late and I have to be somewhere in the morning so I'm gonna stop now.